Hi, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kristen. I'm an eBay reseller. If y'all are new here, we go into Goodwill. We go into Goodwill to go see. I love you. We're going into Goodwill to go see what we can buy and sell online. Let's go. Happy Friday, y'all. We're back to our normal thrifting, <laughs> normal thrifting videos. Made it to the end of the week. That's a speak up. It's just a little Target coffee mug. It says grandfather. It says children of the inner light. I don't know what brand that is. I left that one on the shelf. It did have some wear. I like these little glasses down here. They're dark. Kind of like a gray. It's from a bank. All four of them. I'm trying to find <laughs> in the clear glass section over here. I want to find just like a flat plate. You know, like a clear, really pretty one. So that way I can put um, a planter on top. I have one that doesn't have, as a drainage hole, but it's just a hole. Does that make sense? <laughs> I don't think they really thought that out because <laughs> I can't really put it on my shelf. That's cute. It's $3.99. I normally see these in other colors. They remind me of Easter eggs. I think my mom used to have a yellow one. She might still have it. But. That's $3.99. I might use that one for the plant. I really like the etched flower design on it. It's only on the underside, not on the top. And it kind of, you know, it's not completely flat. So it's perfect. It would catch the water. Hopefully the planter will stay on. <laughs> $2.99. I really want to find a fairy lamp. Now, I've only found one at this location one time. <laughs> Only once. I normally find them at antique stores, but they always have that antique store price. <laughs> I know. But be better than having to pay shipping if I bought it offline. I might have to go to one <laughs> pretty soon because Goodwill is looking pretty dry. I mean, they got stuff. Just not stuff I want. $2.99. That's carnival glass. Guess how much they got it for? I'll tell you. $12.99. $12.99. I have a whole bunch of carnival glass that I bought when I first got into reselling. Because I absolutely love, love carnival glass. But it just sits. I still have every piece, I think, except for two pieces. <laughs> I think I have everything. But the pink ones that I buy that are like the carnival glass, those ones sell pretty fast. Little mason jars right here. $3.99. They're tiny ones. It's platinum. Never been opened. The lids are dirty. It's probably been in somebody's garage. Four wide mouth, eight ounce jars. I don't know how much they go for online or if you will still buy the older ones because that's definitely an older version. The last time I bought lids, or, you know, the, yeah, I think they're called lids. <laughs> the lids and the flat pieces for, like, 50 cents from another thrift store, those ones sold really fast. $2.99. I know, and then on my social media, I see people find fairy glasses or fairy lamps all the time. It's like a little egg. I don't know if it had a lid. I do like it though, but we're going to leave it. Yeah, I don't think it had a lid because of the way it's shaped on the top. That's a dollar ninety nine. Those glasses are really pretty. The ones that are upside down right there. They're not marked, so they should be $0.99, cents, but I guess it depends on... Who checks you out at the cash register, I guess. Lonely little green glass right there. $3.99. Looks like somebody painted that one with flowers. Little deviled egg tray. $3.99. It is like a hand-painted piece. I don't know why they call them deviled eggs. <laughs> when they're just eggs cut in half with like... 
you know, mustard and mayo. <laughs> you know, other seasonings, but you know what I mean. I don't know why they're called that. A little vase, a little bud vase. It's really thin. Two ninety nine. Like I feel like you could crush it. <laughs> How thin it is. It is has some damage on the rim. It kind of looks like little bite marks around the rim. I'm going to leave it. I felt like it weighed nothing. <laughs> Probably could have picked it up and looked at it, but with it being clear, that's why I didn't look it up. Maybe if it was a different color. And y'all heard, y'all saw my chicken drama. Thank you for everybody that commented. Um, they still haven't responded to my emails. I've sent two now. I don't know. We pay our little quarterly dues, like, through checks. They don't take anything online. And I was thinking about just doing, like, a handwritten note <laughs> in there. I don't know. I think it's weird. Maybe they just marked my emails to go straight to spam. <laughs> Or to the trash. They're done with me. I don't know. They have these creepy Christmas dolls. They're $8.99 a piece. There's their face. $8.99. And they had four of them. They all had like the same exact face. But different clothes on. <laughs> I didn't stay right there. Because there was people behind me wanting to look. We're trying to get out the way. <laughs> and I don't videotape other people, so. My daughter found that yellow buggy. We have a buggy, so we don't need another one. <laughs> she puts all of her baby dolls in it. Little dumbbells are $2.99. Probably should have looked at that horse thing that was right next to it, but. My eyes only saw the dumbbell. They're not for resale. <laughs> we do little exercises at home and my kids like to to pretend to participate. <laughs> so I like to have little dumbbells for them. That's only three pounds. And my son has a flashlight. <laughs> We're in the woods section. I do like this section though. A little holy bible thing. I don't know what it is. Three ninety nine. It reminds me of those infomercials. Little chicken. It's a dollar ninety nine. Somebody made that in nineteen ninety nine. He's cute. Dusty. But he's still cute. Little basket. Those are coasters. My daughter found these. They're all different. The top one says Madrid. I have ones that are like almost identical to that, but they're in color. And they still haven't sold. That's why I didn't pick those up. Little granny in a rocking chair. Dollar ninety nine. Says something on the back. Made in USA, but I don't know what the brand is. I can't tell. That one was really dirty. <laughs> it's cute. Definitely a handmade piece. I'm assuming. I don't think they could mass produce that in a factory. Maybe they could. Salt and pepper shakers. These are Texas. I don't know what that says. $1.99. $1.99 each. Now, salt and pepper shakers sit for a while sometimes. And I didn't pick them up. That's $3.99. Scandinavian. I thought it was going to be one of those pieces that move around, but it doesn't. It's a little clock. Some little wooden clogs, $2.99. I got $2.99 each of those. Even though it's a set. <laughs> Maybe you just want one shoe and not both. Daughter's playing with a little salad mixer. <laughs> it's funny. I think we got hooked on that edge. <laughs> edge of the shelf. They had some fake fruit down there. 
I think they were here last time too. I'm going to be setting up my garden this weekend. That's $2.99, that egg thing. It was like a mold. You could put your melted chocolate in there. Candles. Little penguin. Piggy bank, $6.99. He's cute, but not for $6.99. Not from Goodwills. That looks like gum all over it, <laughs> but it's like fabric. It's $5.99. Like rope almost. Little cow, $1.99. Some plates. They still have that ice cream thing. Looks like a little bottle. There's a dragon, a blue dragon, $5.99. Oh, and a hummingbird feeder, $3.99. Gently used. <laughs> it's not terrible. Now, at our house, I haven't seen any hummingbirds the whole two years that we lived here. But at our old house that we lived at, there was always hummingbirds in this one tree. But the last time I tried making a hummingbird feeder, or I bought the little plastic one, probably from the Dollar Tree, and I bought the little, pla not plastic, but it came with like a little mix. It's probably just sugar. But I bought the little mix, and all it attracted was wasps. Like they were drinking out of it. I would just watch them, and they would just drink out of it, and then... When they all flew off, I threw it away. So, I don't know what I'm supposed to put in there. <laughs> I probably need to look it up, but... It was like a little water hose thing, but I think it's not <laughs> for outside. I think it's for, like, your kitchen. There's those hole punch things. I know. I don't know what they're called, but y'all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> $2.99. Some of them are Martha Stewart, is what it says. Like this big butterfly one. $3.99 for the bigger ones. The rest are all Christmas. That one is not. It doesn't feel like it works right. Maybe it would work better if there was a piece of paper. But I'll look it up. They probably sell better if they're new in package. Just for scrapbooking. That's a heart. But it has holes. So, and I can't get that one to press all the way down. Probably because I'm holding it. <laughs> it probably needs to be pushed down on a table. Empty. That's this theater 3D glasses. Two pairs inside. <laughs> that one was stars, but we'll look. Phone cases, some more stamps, $2.99. I remember when scrapbooking was all the rage. They had like little scrapbooking parties. <laughs> I thought it was fun, but now with social media and, you know, you can just keep your pictures on your phone. I don't know if people scrapbook anymore. Mm -hmm. Little Mickey, but he is toe up. <laughs> Well loved. Ooh, a little kitchen. Thirteen ninety nine. Now y'all remember that carnival glass plate that was twelve ninety nine, and this whole thing is thirteen ninety nine, and it comes with the little saucepan. The knife comes out. This would be so fun. <laughs> And y'all, these kitchens are expensive normally. They're normally like one this size is probably $50. And I think it makes sound. But for that price, I can't leave it behind. 
And when my daughter saw it and she was like, I bet it's going to be like $20. And I was like, nope, $13.99. So the kids, <laughs> kids got better stuff than I did today, but we're going to head back home. All right, y'all, we are back home. This is the only thing that I got for resale, which I still think is a pretty good pickup because this... I found ones that had sold, but they didn't have the box. They were just um, just the glasses, and there was the set of four, and they were selling for $20. And since this has the box, it might sell for more because, you know, it's never been used. But the, li the lids are dirty. <laughs> you can see that, but I think that's okay. And then I did get the hummingbird feeder. Now, I just need to look up what to put in there, and then we can get it all set up. And I'll probably put it in my front garden is where I'm planning on putting it and getting one of those I think they're called like um like the shepherd hooks is that what they're called where it's got like two hanging things <laughs> I think that's what they're called anyways and I was thinking about putting it on there and putting it by my hydrangeas I think that'd be really pretty and then of course I did get that kitchen I could not leave that behind not for $13.99 so some of their prices are just crazy to me I don't know how we're pricing a plate for $12.99 that the resell is probably $12.99 for that plate. <laughs> and then we're going to price this $50 kitchen, 50 and up, because there's ones that are more expensive for $13.99. I don't know. Maybe they, I don't know. I don't know who's pricing it, but <laughs> I'm glad they priced it at $13.99. We'll say thank you. <laughs> And my kids absolutely love it. We did let them, I have let them play with it outside and I bring it in so it doesn't get um, weathered. But they fill up the little sink with water. It's the best. <laughs> that is everything that I got today. I hope everyone has a great Friday, great weekend. If you're watching this and it's not a Friday, I still hope you're having a great day. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe.